Welcome back to Simple Deals, Hauls, and Coupons. Today I have the Dollar General Penny List. This is going to be the Penny List for three different days. We have a Penny List for November 7th, November 8th, and November 9th. These are color-coded, so I hope that helps you out as you're watching the video. There's so many pennies coming up starting today um, that I just thought that would be helpful. I'd like to thank the freebieguy.com for posting these extra penny lists. He has a great website if you haven't checked if you haven't checked it out. It's at thefreebieguy.com. He posts all kinds of freebies and deals and he adds new freebies and deals every day. Okay, the penny list for November 7th, we have lawn and garden and camping items. Now this does exclude charcoal, citronella, coolers, vans, grills, hoses, lighter fluid, live plants, potting soil, and propane. Okay, and now we have the next day, which is the penny list for November 8th. November 8th is going to be color-coded in green. Penny list for November 8th includes the $1 Summer Barbecue Fun items. $1 Spring Happy Home items, and that's going to be the green clover items. Uh, those are going to also penny on November 8th. Also included in the penny list for November 8th, baking tier table. That's also green clover items. Beehive home, that's also green clover. That also pennies on November 8th. Black paper, stationery, and apparel, pennies November 8th. Also on the penny list for November 8th, we have Blueprints Home. That's going to be green clover. Fiesta tier table items will penny on November 8th. Green dot home items will penny on November 8th. Safari Home Purple Clover items will penny on November 8th. And the last item on the penny list for November 8th, Shades of Gray items, and that is Purple Clover. Okay, now we're going to the penny list for November 9th, which is color-coded in this light pink purple color. The penny list for November 9th includes pink square swim and summer toys. Now this does exclude bubbles and chalk. You want to look for that pink square on the tag. Also on the penny list for November 9th, Yellow dot spring summer accessories and shoes. And it does exclude flip flops and slippers that will penny on November 9th. All right, so I did some slides here that just uh, show you exactly what's pennying on what day. They're color coded. 
so that if you wanted to screenshot those for your phone, it just makes it easier when you go into the store so you can see exactly what's pinning on that day, and then you'll know the areas you need to go to. So the penny list for today, November 7th, this color coded in this, this uh, turquoise. We've got lawn and garden and camping items. The penny list for November 8th, and of course that's color coded in this bright green, includes the Dollar Spring Happy Home. That items, those are going to be green clover. The $1 Summer Barbecue and Fun items. Baking tier table items, that's green clover. Beehive Home, that's also green clover. Penny list items for November 8th continue. Black Paper Party Stationery and Apparel. Blueprints Home Items, and that's Green Clover, Fiesta Tier Table Items, and the Green Dot Home Items. And the last of our items for the penny list for November 8th, Safari Home, that's Purple Clover, and the Shades of Gray Home, that's also Purple Clover. The penny list for November 9th includes Pink Square, and summer swim toys. And then we have the yellow dot spring summer accessories. Which leads us to this slide. Uh, you never asked Dollar General employees about pennies. I made this mistake when I first started, you know, because I didn't know, I didn't understand how it all worked. So, you know, the reason why we have the pennies, of course, is because. Dollar General employees get the list, and then they're supposed to pull all the things that are on that list. They're supposed to pull off the off the shelves, and it's not supposed to be on the floor so that you know those don't exist. But if they do, if they don't get them off the floor, and Tuesday comes around, then if you scan those items that are on the list for that week, then it should ring up a penny. And so, you know, but just don't ask them about it. You just go in and just take a look around. Okay, and then your miles may vary. The YMMV, and when I first started, I didn't know what they were talking about. That just means your miles may vary, and items in one area might be a penny, and in another area, they might be full price, and I've had that happen to me too. Uh, so, you know, you just need to make sure that if you find an item that you that is on the penny list, scan it because it might be a penny but it might not be a penny and if you scan it then you're more like clear when you go up to the checkout you'll be more confident okay if you are refused a penny item you can show the dollar general penny policy because they are supposed to sell it if it's on the floor and it rings up a penny they're supposed to sell it to you but you know the way i look at it is i don't want to have the confrontation with anyone so if if and I may have been refused a penny before a penny item before I can't really remember but if that happens to me I would just say you know okay that's fine and then I just would not make a big deal about it but you know if you wanted to show them the penny policy and say hey it's right here in your store policy you have to sell that to me you're supposed to sell that to me then you most certainly can it's it's on the next slide okay and here is the dollar Johnny the Dollar General Penny Policy, and it states, penny, penny sales should not occur in a store at any time. If an item rings up for a penny, the item should be sold to the customer for a penny. So that's right in their policy. So if you want to just take a picture of that with your phone, you could have that on your phone ready to go if you needed it. That's all I had for my Dollar General Penny List, and again, that's three different days. Starting today, November 7th, it's November 8th, and November 9th. So I hope everyone's able to go out and find some pennies on these three penny days. If you liked the video, please give me a thumbs up. I hope you'll become a subscriber. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on my next video.